driver for Kawhi Bots this year, at least in first. And uh, I'd like to tell you a bit about the robot. We've got uh, four direct drive Mechanum wheels. They work um, with separate rollers on the wheels. And uh, so that means they can go in any direction at any point, turn really well. Had to get used to those, but they're really good. You know, Not too many of the robots out there on the field had them, so that gave us a bit of an advantage. The basic shape of the robot is a rectangle with the control board right here. We use four Jaguar type motors to drive the wheels. Four for uh, the wheels and then one for the winch and um, one for the tensioner. That's how we use the kicker system is we tension it up, bar goes back, not on this robot, but the one that we actually use for nationals had it. Um, bar goes back and then there's these um, bands of, uh, of rubber that tension it up and then we release it, goes forward. You're only allowed to extend the kicker two inches outside the bumper for two seconds. So we had to work with a very short amount of space. Um, managed to do that. The kicker comes out, goes back. Can kick about 50 feet or so. Um, let's see. Oh, no, the camera. Um, reasonably good. We didn't end up using it too much, but it uses an ethernet cable. Uh, sends back instant feed back to the camera at the driving station and that lets us see whether the ball's in position to be kicked, um, you know, where the other robots are. First, also Each year we go to regionals over in Honolulu. This year it was at the Stan Sheriff Center. And um, that was pretty good. We placed a lot better than we thought, got into the final rounds, the elimination rounds. We didn't win, but um, we got this award, the Engineering Inspiration Award, which uh, allowed us to go to nationals in Atlanta at the Georgia Dome. It was amazing. We had about two weeks or so to plan that trip, and somehow we got it together. We ended up in Georgia flying down, and it was, it was fantastic. Oh, the driver, um, you know, the main driver. We had an assistant driver, Joshua, he's over there. Um, had to train him, actually, after regionals. We realized we could use more on the driving team. He did great for that. Then we all went to nationals. He drove a couple of the matches, did really well, really proud of him. Also on the driving team, we've got our mentor, Logan. He's not here, but um, you know, totally invaluable. Couldn't have done it without him. We had a pit crew of a couple of guys. They helped move the robot, you know, set it up, made sure the battery was working, the camera was working, everything. Our assistant driver, Josh, here, talk for a bit. I told him about the robot and all, but how do you like the Nationals? Uh, I like the Nationals. I think it was a great thing that actually for my first year that I came to robotics, that we as a team of four schools, the four high schools on the island, actually got to Nationals, which is really surprising, which has never been done before. So I found it a great experience. This is Matthew Heller, uh, head pit crew. Um, I think he would like to say a few words on how he liked handling the robot. Yeah, well, basically, um, being in the pit crews, we worked on the robot every time, and we're running out there trying to fix the robot when it broke. After several times, there's probably three times we had to run out when something was wrong that we didn't realize and start wrenching on the thing, and it was pretty fun. There was four of us in the pit crews, and Scott that Lieber, was about it. Um, did all of the programming, C++, you know, got all of the autonomous mode set up. Could you tell us about that? Uh, autonomous mode was where the robot has 15 seconds to uh, basically score as many points as it can. So uh, we come up with a bunch of different scripts uh, and um, the one we really focused on was a script that was in the backcourt where we had three balls and wanted to kick each of those balls into the goal. And Well, sometimes it worked and sometimes it didn't, but it was a lot of fun. Uh, our website is kawaiibots.com, K-A-U-A-I-B-O-T-S.com. Um, let's go there, check it out, learn about the robot, about our team. Um, there's a donate button up in the top left, big green button. You know, help out any way you can, any donations accepted and happily. Um, learn about the team, learn about the mentors. You know, what we do.